Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. We all know that technology is very important for us and it's very true that we can't live without it. So every new gadget that appears is more than welcome. Do you remember when the Bluetooth first appeared in our lives and we could connect some headphones and later on the phones by themselves for transfer different files? First, the Bluetooth 2.0 was good enough for one stable connection and the technology was becoming more advanced, as you all know today, all the new phones use the new Bluetooth technology that allows you to connect more gadgets with your phone in the same time. And what if I tell you that a new type of Bluetooth is being launched? So this happened. Very recently, Nearlink launches six times faster than Bluetooth with 1 30th the latency. Huawei was launched a breakthrough short-range wireless connection tech aiming to combine the advantages of Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. Wow, sounds crazy, right? Faster, more efficient and with a vastly reduced delay, it's also got more than 300 companies and institutions on board. Compared with traditional wireless technologies, Huawei says Nearlink offers 60% lower power consumption, 6 times higher data transmission speed, twice the coverage distance and 10 times more network connections. It will roll out in a variety of devices including consumer electronics. We all have phones, laptops, smartwatches, connected home gadgets, electric vehicles and industrial manufacturing gear. And that's right, they are all becoming a part of Huawei's Harmony OS 4 operating system. It's already integrated into the company's latest. According to the tech radar, nearly all the companies involved with Nearlink thus far are Chinese, notably including Hisense, Honor and Lenovo. The only internationals, it seems, are Taiwan's MediaTek and French construction's material manufacturer Saint Gobain. Now, if you want to take a tour of a city, you might want to take it with an environmental-friendly bike. The bikes also have been integrated with AI. Smelo eBikes is a new name in the e-mobility space and has announced that it's riding into the US with two stylish models designed for urban or city travels. The LX2 and PX2 e-bikes each roll with AI smarts to enhance the riding experience. Smelo is a new sub-brand of Taiwan multinational BESV, which is responsible for the design of the LX2 and PX2 city rides. It features a 250 watts motor with a torque sensor in the bottom bracket for a distance up to 20 miles per hour with a handy boost mode to outsmart traffic and conquer any slopes. A simple LED display built into the stem shows key ride info with a USB port included for topping up mobile gadgetry while out and about. AI brains have been installed within the top tube to learn a rider's power output and not only provide automatic shifting, but also predictive range based on their power output and riding patterns. The setup automatically shifts between seven Shimano gears and adjusts pedal assist from the motor for a smooth ride. The circuitry works with an app over Bluetooth ILI for system analysis and optimization and should an issue be detected, the app can guide the rider through troubleshooting. The app can also be used to track the bike's location and battery status, set the alarm and crash alerts and unlock the smart lock on user approach. The LX2 has an aluminium frame that's ready for riders between 5.6 and 6.3 feet in height and sports an integrated 380 lumen LED headlight plus a braking tail light. It comes with a big battery, a 500 watts battery that means it can go on a distance from 37 to 74 miles per charge. Riding the bike is equipped with Shimano hydraulic brakes. The PX2 lowers its frame is 5 and 5.6 feet. The battery is smaller compared with the LX2, it can only run the bike for 50 miles. And like the LX2, it features Shimano hydraulic disc brakes but rolls on CST tires. The bikes are ready for pre-order and you have to prepare your wallet. The price starts from around $2800. Until January next year, they'll only be available in California, but deliveries to other regions will be added through 2024.
That's it for today guys, if you want to be the first to know about the latest gadgets and news from technology, don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. If you want to know more, leave me your questions or comment in the comment section below.